Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls. This is the Daily Angelic Message for June 18th, 2024. Now I'm looking down here because it's a good one, all right? It's it's a lovely, lovely card. And it is Nine of Raphael, Make a Wish, Dreams Become Reality, A Joyful Time of Life. There's a big breakthrough going on here. If you go back and watch the weekly, I get into that a little a uh, bit more in depth. So uh, something's healing with the divine masculine uh, that could be out in the world as well. But definitely this is a time to not make a shallow wish. You know, I preach about that all the time because we'll miss the point. If we're just focused on, you know, surface level things, uh, wishing for more wishes <laughs> kind of thing because, you know, that's greedy and we just want to keep making the most of it. Um, th it's not that. It's not that. To me, this is a wish fulfillment because you stop and you realize how good you have it. Now, some of you who are in a really low place, there's always love, okay? There is always love. You have my love. You have the love of this community. You have the love of your community, whether you believe that or not. It's there, okay? You always can reach out for help. People really do care. I promise you. Now, there's a lot of a-holes out there, too. Trust and belief, okay? <laughs> you are validated, okay? <laughs> like, I'll give you that. But, you know, there are people out there who are good and kind and want to see you do well. They want to see you succeed. So please do not feel like you are excluded from having a wish come true for you. It might not be the wish that you always thought it would be, but maybe it's something even better. Now, if you want to get a reading with me, go to angelsouls444.com. I don't know where I'm going to be with live reading spaces by the time you see this, but you can always email me, angelsouls444 at gmail.com. I said in the weekly that um, I, every once in a while I'll get like, I don't know, it happens in spurts where people email me and they want, they're like treating me like I'm on a job interview to see if they're going to choose me for a reading. <laughs> That's awesome. Good on you. But I'm, I won't. I, I respectfully decline that. Um, thank you. But yeah, I won't be answering those emails and asking like job. I don't know. It's like job interview type questions and grilling me about how I do things. Like the whole reason why I had a channel in the first place was to show what I can do. So you either want one or you don't. Okay. <laughs> but if you be a little honest here. Okay. But if you... <laughs> I would encourage you to take the same approach. If someone, if you know, if you're well established and you know what you're doing and you've shown people over and over and over that you know what you're doing and they're still trying to test you, ugh, that's something else, okay? So email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com. We're going to leave it there for today. I love you guys. Take care.